Okay, breakaways are really important uh, in street self-defense or any law enforcement system. What you don't have to do is always be involved in the fight. If someone grabs me, I don't have to do a crazy technique. What I can do is easily break away. That gives me space to go to the next technique or to think about what my options are. It's important if I'm grabbed here, that like I take a defensive position. So if I'm just stood here and Mark goes for the grab, from there I'm going to take a defensive position straight away. The reason for that is, he's not just there to grab my hand, he's there to pull me in and go for the next strike. So if I'm here and I take a defensive position and he goes on to the next drill, then I can move and execute my techniques. So we're working on the yellow tag, this is going to be the first three breakaways that we do from a straight wrist grab. It's really important I open up my hand. What that does for me is increases my wrist mass. That's going to open up his hand, so if I need to come in and go into a strike. I'm breaking easily out of the thumb and the fingers that are holding me there. That's my exit point. So from here we're going to work two basic breakaways. The first one we're going to do is a horizontal. We've got three breakaways, but two breakaway positions. So number one from here, I'm going to take a step forward, break straight into the face. If for some reason when I do this break here, his hand comes through, I'm in a guard position. That's cool, throw that back for me. I'm in guard position here already. So everything stays closed. But from here we're going to execute nice and quickly. <laughs> I'm going to go straight into the strike. What I'm not aiming to do here is pull that hand forward. If I pull and he's raised, he's ready to strike from here, I'm actually bringing him into what he wants to do. So on this breakaway here, step, coming straight in. So I'm not becoming defensive, I'm not stepping back too much. So moving, this is working on the horizontal breakaway. We're going to use the same thing again, only this time my hips are going to set up the technique. So from here, my hip starts to turn. And it's a back, back fist strike coming through. Again, from here, my hip turns, I give my breakaway, and I strike. Now, why am I putting this hand down there? It's quite key that if he grabs me here and I start to move, if he throws that strike in, I'm ready for the next step. Number three, this is the change. I said we have two breakaways. The first two are horizontal, this one becomes vertical. So from here as I step forward, grab on really nice and tight. Bang on through. Just from stepping forward, doing the vertical raise, we get him to start moving. If we get him to start moving, then we're doing good. So from here, vertical break, elbow under the chin, grab the nearest shoulder, bang with straight hand. 